Boxing fans, tonight's next contest is the men's 156-pound novice class. The referee is Frank Martinez. In the goal corner, Takumbo Alajade of Kingsway Boxing Club. Alajade lives in Jamaica, Queens, and is a student at the Urban Academy in Manhattan. This is his first gloves. He is the Metro's champion. He enters tonight's contest with an impressive tournament record of one disqualification and three knockouts. In the blue corner, Daniel Judah of Judah Brothers Boxing Club. Judah is in the 11th grade at Midwood High School. Last year he won his first gloves about and then had to pull out after he was hurt in a street assault. He has won the Metros. He steps into the ring with two decisions and two knockouts. These two fighters have faced each other before in the Metros when Judah in a 3-2 split according to Judah, but a 5-0 split according to Elijah Day. Elijah Day, the winner of the fight. Well, Judah is one of those difficult tall southpaws that are very, very hard to fight. Elijah Day in the goal, the brother of Michael Elijah Day, who is a very good middleweight fighter. Lost right here at Madison Square Garden to Iran Barkley. Trained by his father, Michael Elijah Day Sr. Daniel Judah, 17 years old in the blue, out of the Judah Brothers Boxing Club. His father is his trainer, Noel Judah. Nice combination by Elijah Day, digging to the body, too. The 156 pound novice division. Martinez warning Elijah Day for the second time, cautioning Elijah Day for the second time. Martinez fixes the shirt of Daniel Judah. See, Judah knows his way around the amateurs when he's not doing anything else. At least he's slapping with that, those hands and scoring points. Judah, good right hand followed by a left. Judah made a nice movement there, turning around and then countering. They have stolen the first round at the end, and Daniel Judah, not afraid of the man staring at him in the other corner. I fought him in the Metros, and uh, I came in, I had a flu, you know. But, yo, I ain't say nothing, you know, and he, I lost 3-2. That's my decision, you know, but, you know, I'm going to find a little back. I'm, I mean, eating, you know, back then, I was, I was coming at like 151, 156, and that's not no way for me. Now I'm coming at 156 when I die, you know, so I'll be ready for this fight tonight. Okay. Elijah Day, according to his corner, it was not a 3-2 split. It was a 5-0 decision okay. in which Elijah Day clearly won the fight. Okay, baby. But Daniel Judah looking at it differently. And we begin round two. Elijah Day storming out of his corner. Fighters clinching, broken up by Frank Martinez. Elijah Day, compact left hand land. Elijah Day loses his balance. Michael Elijah Day Sr. feels that his son Takumbo 
It's a once in a lifetime fight. Well, he's, he's got a very tough opponent in front of him. But he's just the worst kind of guy to display your talent against. I've stayed fighting for two years. Judah fighting for close to 12 years. Left hand by Elijah Day. Lands. Elijah Day. Bill using the jab to set up his right hand. Well, he's trying anything he can do to get into this big tall the south court, but uh, very, very difficult opponent. Tough can of worms to open. 